After one big local head-to-head -head matchup, let's see how things shake out in the mines. Here's this week's high school football coal scale rankings. In the league night grade, these teams are looking for a spark. Shenandoah Valley was shut out by Schuylkill Haven as the Hurricanes tried to power their way to another Schuylkill League Division II title. This week, the Blue Devils travel to hometown to face Marion Catholic. The Colts are also winless after falling to Panther Valley. The Panthers were down 10 points early but scored 21 unanswered points in the second quarter and used several explosive plays to sink Marion. The Colts freshman running back Xavier Oscasio rushed 31 times for 148 yards and a touchdown, while Lucas Troya booted a 42-yard field goal. Hazleton area only managed 24 yards of offense against Berwick in a 42-7 loss. Two fumbles on special teams cost the Cougars as Berwick cashed in with touchdowns. We have a feature story this week on the Young Cougars on SSP TV News, and we talk with junior James Bugda, who recovered a fumble in this game. Monoy area is up in the bituminous grade for our teams that are heating up and almost on fire. Monoy area area bounced back from a loss to Schuylkill Haven by beating Minersville 41-25 in a Schuylkill League Division II game. Ben Terry scored three touchdowns for the Bears and rushed for 150 yards on eight carries. He also grabbed an interception to add to his stat sheet. Quarterback Danny Lawrence led the Bears with 20 carries for 166 yards and two touchdowns. Up in the anthracite grade, our two hottest teams of 2019 squared off in Week 7 with North Schuylkill getting a 27-18 win over Tamaqua. It was a three-point game when the Spartans' Jake Green capped off a drive that took over seven minutes with a 17-yard touchdown run in the fourth quarter and on fourth down. North Schuylkill quarterback Jaden Leiby rushed for 143 yards and a touchdown, and he tossed a 56-yard touchdown pass to Dylan Deeds, who also had an interception for the Spartans. Zach Chowanski compiled 123 rushing yards and a touchdown. Tamaqua's Braden Knobloch passed for 174 yards in the loss. North Schuylkill is now 2-0 in Schuylkill League Division I play, and the Blue Raiders are 1-2. The Spartans seem to have a lock on the top spot in the Cole scale with three weeks left, but who knows? Anything can happen in Cole Region football.